Hello and welcome to part 13 of my let's play of Fallen Enchantress Legendary Heroes Beta. Well, as you remember last time, I was preparing for the invasion of the Gildan to annihilate them once and for all and just cement my power. And that's pretty much it at the moment. So I've got reinforcements coming to over here which is going to take Raiden form and then slowly and surely make its way into the Imperium. Whereas my main force is going to strike up here take out the outposts and be, well, just just annihilate them basically and possibly receive reinforcements for the, from the army that comes up here as well once they've taken that out. So let's see what I can still move with him, the useless man. We've got this army just sitting there, let's just, just tell them to guard. And there's some pioneers there, aren't they cute? And that's, all, that's it apparently. Okay, let's go on to the next turn and see if anything good happens. I sure hope it does. So I'm still worried about these uh, fellas with, with the towers, Resident and Pre Praden. That still does worry me quite a bit. Magnar's only got one, then don't have to worry about them for now. But as soon as they get their fourth one and they start going for the Forge of the Underworld, it's going to be an immediate war, I can tell you that. Still got this bloody Drake here, look at him. Thinks he's so cool. Uh, I'm going to move this army up. Because they've had quite a lot of forces up here. I don't think. I think it's definitely worth having a big force taken up here. Also to see if I can push forward into Imperium and kill lots of stuff. Because I really want to do that. I've, I'm really looking forward. It's got iron there. It's got shards. Ogre's place. I want to know what else it has in there. But I'm more worried about is this is quite close. So it might stop me from building a town in here. Which is what I'm supposed to do. I don't know if that was a bug, so I might have to raise that place once I capture it. Because I'm a slave lord, I still get the population of my capital, so it'll be too much of a bother. In fact, I'm going to rush these guys. I'm getting impatient. Come along, boys. Get in there. Oh, it's full. So as soon as this army reinforces the one up here and starts moving on, I'll be going to war, I think. Right, I'm going to move this army just a little bit up closer. There we go. They're going to. See, I don't know if that's going to um, alert these people I'm going to war or not. Knowing Stardock, they probably got something in there telling them it is. In fact, yeah, I'm going to have to move them back a bit just in case. I remember in Galactic Civilizations 2 where allies thought you were going to war with them because you ha happened to move army, for, move navies through their territory. That was fun. Okay, everything's done. Hurry up, I want to destroy these bastards. The Magnar have declared one in the Gilded. Oh, that'll take some of their resources away from the fight. Ah, oh, yes it will. The evening match, so yeah, they're going to have a bit of trouble. Let's see who else they're at war with. They're quite hostile towards me. They're unfriendly towards the Aethril. I don't really care about the Aethril, they got nothing. Oh, that's me. Sorry, that's me. They're at war with Aethril, Magmar, Resilin, Capita. Ooh, they're all with everyone. I may as well get some of the pickings while I still can. And let's have a look at... Uh, I can't remember who else is going to have a look at now. Anyway, I think that town's going to fall. Where is it? The one next to Imperium's going to fall to another some, someone else re soon. So I think I'm going to have to move my forces up there quick, sooner rather than later. Oh! No, I don't want to speak to... There are, oh, that means Capitar about to invade. So, four tur six turns apparently until I'm there. I don't know if it, the town will still be uh, still be mine by the time they get there. Still be theirs, even. Damn, this is not going as planned. If that happens, anyway. In fact, I'm just going to go... Oh, no, I don't want him to take away reinforcements to attack me. Um, that would be, be a problem. I've got to wait to the precise time when I have that town. Then I can attack. That is the time. Oh, look at all this cool shit. Well, I've irrigated farm, more food. This is still a level 2 town. I need I need more stuff. I thought that would give me a growth bonus, but apparently not. Oh, I, I, oh, I do like the money, and I do like my mana. I still haven't got a black market. I'm not too keen on that plus 5 unrest. I know it's quite a small bit of unrest, but I'm still not keen on it. See, this army's moving up slowly. 
If I take him out and it's just these guys, they'll move far faster because he's a bit slow by himself. So let's do that. He's getting these troops up here is more important than having him up here. Oh, it'll take seven turns to get there. I'm cool with that. Going that way. So they don't meet, meet anyone nasty on the way. In fact, instead he can come up here. Oh no, he stops right next to that drink. Let's hope. Yeah, I'll have to rearrange some stuff so he doesn't stop right next to a friggin' drake, but hey. That army, you can just guard. Next turn. Oh, I'm looking forward to this war. It's going to be a good war. Is it? No. Why are you trying to boss me about? I should be going to war with you, you crazy bitch. The Altar are mine. I'm gonna get. Oh, I'm gonna get that later for when I have that ogre's den. I'm gonna get. That's only four turns, and let's me get the ironworks, which is a world achievement. Plus eight, and it's plus eight metal. That's just too good not to have. And I can get a mill. I can get a great, great mill, whatever it's called. But I can't get a normal mill at the moment. That's peculiar. Very peculiar. Yep, move up as fast as you can. That's more wildlands there by the looks of it. As you notice, I have wildlands set to many because I like the idea of exploring them, although I, I very, very rarely get around to actually doing it unless I've got a really good hero in an army. Pretty late game, usually. I'll send these guys about. There you go. And I'm going to have to send this guy this way because I do not want him to get drakeified. I still remember that army going to invade Umber. These poor, poor lads. I suppose this is the problem with the mounts and heroes is the heroes don't move as much unless they're on mounts. But then if your mounts are guys are on mounts, then you're slowing them all down for the sake of one hero, unless it's your sovereign or it happens to be a mounts hero. So that's one thing that's a, a bit of a bugger. Just him. Let's go on. Let's... Wild horses are now within my zone of control. Where are these wild? Oh, horses down here. You are mine. All mine. This carrier still not built. My armies are still not up. Why have they built an outpost there? For the iron, really. As soon as. Next turn. That'll be friggin' mine. I don't. You monument. We'll you out of. What you and your friggin' outpost everywhere. Stealing my shit. You. Ah, oh, you ruffian bastard. I could build a town there. But you. Tch, uh. Oh, there happens to be a river slag. Wonderful. I walk into the most wonderful of places, it would seem. This is a pioneer rush down to the single place they haven't got a town yet. Right there, I'd, I'd like to have a town there because it would uh, link up these two areas. So I might say, how far am I find building pioneer? It would take. Oh, I've got a mage. It would take. Where's the pioneer? I've already gone past, haven't I? Where the frig is the pioneer? There is the pioneer. Six turns. I'm going to shove it in right there. And if I can, if I can get the pioneer to get around these monsters and build that, I'm going to do it. It's probably going to die horrifically, but I don't care. I really don't. I like having lots of towns. I know it's not the best idea because you get lots of unrest. But hey, I like it. What are you going to do? Oh! This guy's close. Step away. And this town here. I'm just going to build some light cav. Because like how Oh, lights of Kaldar. I'll get them. Why not? I've only got charged, but hey, I don't care. They're cheapish. I'll send these guys up here as reinforcements. It's always good to have more, more and more reinforcements. Hurry up and get your asses down here, boys. Oh, they can actually pop straight through. Ah, oh, fantastic. We'll go straight through here. And four turns, that town is mine. And they're going to meet up with these guys, even better. 
If there was Age of Wonders, you could do like a two pronged attack, but unfortunately, you have to, on this game, you have to meet up and then attack. It's, yeah, I much prefer the battle system in Age of Wonders. I lust for it, actually. I think I might play that game sometime soon. Get on up there. Missing finger man. There we go. What else needs to move? That's it. Let's go on to the next turn and see if anything exciting happens. Hopefully it does. I'm looking forward to it. Anything? Oh, Magnar, I've got all three town all the three cities now. The towers even. Oh yeah, whatever. But shit, I've got another country to deal with now. And why have you got pioneers here, you crazy bastards? Unsafe territory, it's just. They've got armies everywhere, haven't they? They're just. Their power's slowly rising, but. They don't stand a chance once I'm at war with them. Why are they stopped? What's. Oh, Crystal Crag. I thought it was like a dragon's lair or something. Dragon statue. New Decay. That's a wonderful name. Why have they got. Chainmail on archers. Ah, oh, and they got the walling here. Cool. Chainmail. That just doesn't seem right. Let's move in. Let's, uh, oh, so that means I've got a town that's not building anything. Sacrilege. Let's build a tax office. I do like my tax. Okay, almost the next turn. The best thing about them being next to Wildlands is I can get right next to the town, declare war on them, and attack them in the same turn, instead of having to walk slowly through their territory. Oh, he's under attack. Who bite? There's no point in even playing that. He's going to die so bad. Yeah. They leveled up, though, so it's not all a loss for them, I suppose. Build a command post, or I'm going to get a forge because it's only three turns, and then I think I'm going to get some more long swordsmen. Get some of those royal guard chaps, except oh, there's there's expensive ones. No, let's go like cav. I need far more cavalry. There we go. Send up the reinforcements. Send these chaps over here. Oh, they're so close now. Next turn they'll be united, and then they'll be at war, and then they'll attack. Oh, it's all go it's all going punky dory. It's freaking grand. These guys can actually start to advance. Oh, they can advance right there. In fact, they might be a bit closer if they're over here. But I'm going to keep them here because their armies can still use that road, so they can still use it to attack me. So it'll take two turns to attack that town. But I'm cool with that. These long swordsmen come up here. I'm going to reinforce this army when they're with their inevitable casualties. Yeah, let's walk past Drake. Old Papa Drake. I can rename him. Let's I'm going to call him Old Papa Drake. I don't know why. I'm just doing it. Old Papa Drake. There we go, Old Papa Drake's army. Mm. Only one ogre now. Did did that army they had around here attack it? Because they already killed my bastard. Mm. My guy's there, that bastard. Okay, next turn. The war starts. I'm looking forward to it. Ironworks, mill, all that good stuff. Get some more of that. Could get some more of this stuff. Whew, what should I get? Don't think I need any of this stuff, really. I'm quite high. Ooh. I'm going to get some more magic stuff, just because I can. I'll get rituals. I don't even know really what it gives me. Let's go for it. Oh, sorcery looks kind of cool. It's got lots of spells there. Tireless March. Oh, Tireless March is quite good. I think I might have to get that. 
I may be missing out on loads of cool spells because I've been uh, not doing stuff, but hey. Sons, son of the forge. Not sons, but just... You bastards! Fucking hell. Oh my god, I hate it when they do that. Just put... Oh. Next. Fuck. Shit. Bloody pioneers. Fuck them. Ah, from the Empire. So I finally come to behold the Fable Nailgate. Good fortunes from the Empire of Harrenfell, and may our forthcoming meeting bring hope to our people. That's my uh, my mate, the faction I usually use. I call them just the Empire on here. I actually you know, renamed them recently to the Empire of no, the Holy Empire of Anthes because it sounds kind of a uh, like the Holy Roman Empire, or the Holy Cyrillic Empire of the Old Scrolls. Don't ask me why. I just did it. Well, sound kind of cool. Uh, let's see. Oh, Zion, it's a town. Armor oh, labor cost discount. I kind of like that, but I kind of like more troops. More, more troops count more. Like have, sorry, town upgrades, but it's got to happen. Oh, I've got like have. Oh, fantastic. That's. Send them up here. We got, I think we got something like five movement altogether with the cavalry. What are they doing around here? I don't like it. I'm going to use this force here to uh, destroy them when I go to war because they've got quite a lot of guys around here. I don't, I'm not liking it. I'm not liking it one little bit. So I'll reinforce this outpost here. As much troops as possible. So on the next turn, definitely war. Definitely war next turn. Blood season. The air crackles with the scent of lightning, and arcane magic and energy has now been set loose upon the world. An energy that feeds the savage in man and fallen alike. An energy that strips away the mask of civilization and lets loose the beast within. All players declare war on every other player they know unless they are in an alliance. Fuck me. Whoa. Good freaking timing. Whoa. Oh, I've never seen this event before. Oh. Oh. Ho ho ho. Ho. Oh. Oh. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> This is going to be entertaining. <laughs> oh, that's it. I'm going to have to... Like... Oh, that's... This is... Oh, this has been destroyed by someone. By him. Because he got the event and then allowed to move the bastard. But <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's... That is an amazing event. I did not expect that. Friggin' hell, I'm at war with everyone. Let's just destroy this town then. Oh, that's... That is the best event ever. <laughs> that is so amazing. I love that event with... Oh, just... Just yes. It's <laughs> all I can say. <sighs> oh, I'm so happy. Oh, just... I'm so happy I got that event. Oh, look at that. Oh, this is... This is turning out... I, I'm really enjoying this now. Oh, you saw me. Oh, you bastards. Oh, look at that. Down in one. Long swords for the win. Warriors, you shit. You're going to go over here. Well done, warriors. You have proved yourself to be crazily shit. Crazy, crazily, amazingly shit. Oh, well done. Now, crossbowmen. 
There we go. Oh, they're still not finished off. What's going on? Oh, there we go. Got a phrase then. Nine population? Huzzah, my town. Let's just... When the unrest goes down, we'll just build a build ta um, bell tower there. Can't really do much else. So they've been expelled from my territory. I'll go straight towards the town and attack that. There we go. Strong versus strong. This is going to be one hell of a fight. And if I lose, I've still got those reinforcements down there to uh, back them off. So I'm going to keep try and kill as much things that aren't militia, just in case I do lose. Oh, look at all the archers. Freaking hell, they've got loads of archers. I wish I had more. It feels like they're spamming it. 15 damage. But have I got a spell that takes away their damage? Let's do that with a... Oh, I've got this cool firebolt, firebolt spell. Could hurt them or not, but I, I want to take out some of these archers before they turn out to be too much of a pain. 7-4. They're all 7-4. Okay. City archers. I'll just take out normal ones. Oh, they resist... Oh, because they're good and they get resistance to spells, don't they? I forgot about that. They get plus 20 weight capacity. That's pretty useful. That would be pretty useless in the next update, but hey. Um, yeah, plus uh, tactical... Oh, no. Ta plus 30 spell resistance. This is going to be a hell of a game. Did they just skip all of their goes? Oh, they went for the archers, that's why. Oh, come on. I hope their archers are just as useless as that. Better have a bad feeling they're not going to be. Although some of them are withered, which is good. Well, they're taking two of them and they've got no armour. So they're not doing too great. So yeah, this, I, th I thought this was going to be a bit difficult. No, this is going to be a cakewalk, as they say in some places of the world. Magic fire sword. Can never be a good magic fire sword. They're always good fun. Let's take out more of these archers. There we go. Killed one. Load the attack even more. I want to get a cleave right in the middle. So I'll get him here. And. Oh, look at that. You worried about city militia? What city militia? I'd say I'm just gonna, those archers are too crap for them to actually do anything to resist me. So I'm just going to walk up to them. They're going to do some damage to it up there, maybe, but that's about it. Oh my god, these long swordsmen just. They're too. What's the term? Boss. That's exactly the term I'm looking for. Oh. Who's going to get counterattacked? Oh. She did quite well, actually. Bastards. Not allowed to do well. Let's slow him. There we go. Where's your horses now? Oh, look at that. Let's take out the archers that aren't withered. Oh, 10 damage. Still nothing, though, comparatively. Let's finish off these guys. Oh, yes! Now we're just going to charge these folks. And laugh and glory and all that good stuff. Oh! Let's finish off these ones. Hopefully. Oh, no. Hurt them bad, though. Didn't even do anything. Wow, these guys are doing awful. 
Oh, they're hurting these guys a bit. I stress a bit, not much at all. This is going to be a, this battle is going to be a resounding success. I thought when I said they were strong, it was going to be a bit more difficult, but no, they're just they're terrible. <laughs> so let's send you guys over here. Right, let's finish these ones over off here. Cause look at them with their high amount of health. <laughs> There you go, take that. Bastards. Oh, they're still alive! Finish them. There we go, that's what I like to see. Jump in there and finish these... I said finish these guys off. Or not. Whatever. Your choice. Still not dead. Friggin' hell, come on. What do I pe Oh, I didn't move a f oh fuck. Let's see these are They've actually badly hurt those archers. It's a good thing they're useless. Sorry, what's wrong with these guys? Oh my god, really? There we go. Ah, oh, slaughtered. This feels good, just lambs the friggin' slaughter. Oh my god, you're you woman. A broken spirit sting has a pain in the ass. Minus twenty five percent accuracy in everything. In fact these archers are nearly useless at the moment. And just poor little Archer left, all by her lanes himself. Not anymore, she's not. Because she's dead. Oh yes, it's my town now. And that means these guys can move freely to attack these guys over here. How many of them are there? Spillman, Warrior, and Archer. I think I can take them on. I think I can destroy them with the power of my mind, swords, swords, not mind. Let's go over here. But I'm going to shield bash. It's got, no, I'm not going to shield that. Take away from the from the whole swarm mechanic. Did they just get a counter attack? Oh no, he just actually used his actual attack. Never mind. Send him here. He's finished. I'll send this guy here, finish off these warriors. Oh, nearly. Not quite, my friends. Not friggin' quite. Oh! I like these cavalry. And a mad rush against the archers. Oh, this is just undoing the work. Uh, feels good to me, me. I can tell you that. Although now I have to worry about attack from everybody else. But that's not too bad, I hope. Because I haven't got much armies down here, so th I could pop. Oh! I've got no forces. Oh shit, I should have thought about this before setting the. Oh no! That town's so lost. Drake, old Papa Drake, what are you doing over here? You finally needed. Oh shit, everyone, just build shit troops, I don't care. I oh, know, you can't, no. Uh. Can you build troopers that, that, no, they're cheap, oh no. Oh dear. When you build anything. No, oh my, no, my days. What's che built cheaper than them? Uh, quicker than them? Short swordsman. Only five seasons. You are my new favourite troop because you're cheap. Knights of Kaldar. Let's see. Short swordsman. Seven. 
they're not as good, but they take less turns, and I need more troops to defend everywhere at the moment. Oh my god, I'm gonna. This town is lost. Alain Al Hassan. I'm sorry, my town. You are lost. It's the African scum who are gonna be destroyed very, very soon, hopefully. Ah, oh, this should come to some interesting predicaments. Anyway, I'm gonna wait till the uh, next turn. Next time, sorry. To continue to see the fallout from this uh, blood season, whatever it's called. So I'll, uh, I'll catch you next time.